Yo, what's going on, 67 on the squad today? We're here doing a rank of one, and it is patch day, and patch day means new fun things to experiment with, which I have right here for you. A 2.5% increase on Curse Weaver, which, I, <clears throat> if you are mathing, is a 50% increase, which is massive. 50% more damage and health, plus 10 more power on Rod of Tahuti, plus power on Stone of Gaia, which helps with the damage of Curse Weaver. I'm thinking you compare all three of those things together, and um, I want to see how much power you get, actually, from this. You get 25 magical power while it's not on cooldown. It will never be on cooldown because of the person I'm fighting. So I actually think we're in a really good spot. So I'm going to start Warlocks, obviously. Warlocks builds into Curse Weaver, and you get infinity va value. Infinity value. <clears throat> and I'm going to go probably just Thorns. This, this, this. Uh, Kumba also got buffed. Hold on. I have to, I have to go ahead and pause this and all the way down here. I'll let you guys see my neom. Neom all the way down to Kumba, which where's the boy? There he is. So, uh, Kumba's first two basic attacks are cleaves. Massive change. He gets better base protection. Massive change. Better HP and mana off of his passive and HP five while his passive is on cooldown. Insane change. Lower mana, lower cooldown on his one. No more DR on his two. They did lower the, the amount of root from two seconds to 1.5, but no DR means it's better. Um, And his three does damage. So, and his alt got a, got a cooldown reduction. Every single ability in Kumba's kit got buffed. Every single one. And his, every single ability and his auto attacks and his passive. <laughs> And his starting defenses. Everything about Kumba got buffed. All at the same time. So it's pretty insane. I think it's pretty miraculous. Could be in, could be maybe a new dual god. Especially with the Curse Weaver, Rod, and Gaia buffs too. God forbid they're, they're able to proc the Gaia. Oh my god. Now you're just going too far. Alright, I want to toss the mini into them. I didn't toss the mini into them. So I'm going to actually do beads. Or not beads. Perfect. Oh, I was killing the... I, da, 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 da. I forgot that my auto attacks cleaved after I just said it. Hold on, look at this, look at this, look at this. Cleave, cleave. Oh my god, it's amazing. Boom. I missed. Hold on, look, look, look. Damage. Boop. Extra 42. It literally doubled the damage. Oh my god, I'm so tanky too. I'm insane. I mean, not me. I'm not insane. Goomba's insane. Can I mez a buff for more damage now? You can mez a buff for more burst damage. All right. Hold on. Hold your horses. Hello. Wait, I'm dead. Wait. Oh, he missed. Nope. Oh, he beats. Nice. Yeah. Oh my god, he's getting owned. Wait, I have a passive. I have a passive. I have a passive. Oh shit. Wait. 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 Fuck. <laughs> oh man. Mario bro killed me. Oh, he's going Itchaval first item. That item is goaded. By the way. Um, I have a second channel. The name is I'm Sam the Dude. Please look it up and please subscribe. It would mean the world to me. We're uploading our first video tomorrow. Um, I have... Actually, I'm not going to lie. I have like a whole team for this channel. My... my This main channel right now, it's pretty much just ran by me. Um, But on my second channel, which is I'm Sam the Dude, I have two editors. Me and my friend were all working on it. So... And one of my editors is also my wife. So there's a lot of work going into it. Got high hopes. I don't really care about this ult. Wait, why did I not get missed? Oh, you probably just hit me at the right time. What is this? What is this icon right here? Is that HP five from my? Is that HP five from my passive? I actually don't know what that is. 
I have to go breastplate though. I have to go this and this. Um, as long as I don't get too far behind, I'm pretty confident that I'll be fine this game. I won't be able to one hit him, but I mean, with Curse Weaver, I don't need to one hit him. I need to win the sustain battle, which I'm pretty confident in doing. I don't know. Did Cupid get any buffs here? I don't know if Cupid got some some nasty buffs or not. I didn't really pay attention to Cupid buffs. Now, I did get this weird skin, which I honestly hate. Hello. Bonk. Bonk, bonk. Okay. I was going to try to kill him there, but... He's too good at the... He's too good at the running. He's too good at the part that I can't chase. I mean, there's no... There's just no way. Oh, dude. That combo almost owned him. Wait, he's dead here? Ooh! Let's go! I landed the snipe! I landed the snipe. Let's actually go. That combo is insane, though. If you, uh, if you alt and thorns pretty much at the same time, then you can, like, guarantee a thorns proc, basically. Because it'll proc right when they land. And even though he dashed right when he landed, my thorns still landed, so. Even if they're prepped for it, they still get owned by it. Cupid didn't get buffed? All right, perfect. Perfect. Okay, now I got 20% cooldown. I am going to go Book of Thoth because Curse Weaver is not only good... I thought I heard him doing my blue for a second. Curse Weaver is... No hey! 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 No, you do not! Anyways, Curse Weaver is not only good uh, with your HP... It scales off your HP and your mana. So, Book of Thoth obviously being like a thousand mana. Kind of good. All right, now you dash. You actually can't fight me. Also, something to note. This lowers attack speed and gives them a slow when you break it early. So, previously, it I mean, it still lowered their, their attack speed and gave them a slow. But it didn't actually do damage. So, now... Picking up Scepter as Kumba doesn't feel that bad. You used to hate it because you'd be like, oh, my my three does nothing. But it actually kind of helps you proc it really fast for better burst damage. No idea where he is. I have found him. Hello. The Shoguns. I don't really mind any kind of damage he deals. He's doing 51 damage. 51 is not much. How much is book? I think it's 1850, correct? Why didn't you dash this way? Well, you didn't dash that way. You just used your two, and it sounded like your dash. I get it. I get it. Nice. I am very confident that I can I can fight him. Maybe I should not be. Oh, okay. Ow. His dash is down. Oh, I think. Wait. I'm dead. Wait, that didn't stun. I'm I'm alive. I'm alive. Oh, nice. Okay. Oh, what if that killed him, though? That would have been sick. I feel like Soul Reaver will also be good. Just because... Um, well, let's go tier one Gaia. Just because of the fact that it gives you 300 mana and it's a proc item. And that, that proc item will also do well with the whole Curse Weaver build that I am doing. All right, even though we're 1-1 one, one, and it seems like he has more pressure on me, I'm actually I'm actually out farming him something fierce right now. now I will say this Gaia is not going to be a great item for me right now. It's going to be really good once I get Curse Weaver online. So I'm going to finish Gaia and then finish Curse Weaver. 
Normally, I wait a bit to finish my Curse Weaver. I mean, yeah, I never kill him here. I will need a Divine. There should be treasure chests up, right? I'm just going to back. Second relic, I might need blink, but or I might need uh, beads, but I'm going to go blink just because I'm Kumba. And if you fire blink and then you mez them in the fire blink, <clears throat> they take an extra tick of damage, which is very nice. I don't want him doing bull demon ever. I don't really think he's the bull demon kind of guy. You must be this is a stun, but I don't really mind because I'm kind of owning him. I do think you're dead here. Oh my goodness. Close. Close. All right, he's missing that entire wave worth of XP, which is, is so nice for me. That is so nice for me. Okay, and now I have Gaia, which gave me a lot of HP, HP5 and MP5. But it also gave me 25 magical power, which is pretty nice. It is pretty nice. The blue buff is soon. I can pick that up after I clear this wave. I guess he's getting he's getting rock right now, right? How much is Curse Weaver? Because I need that now. Twelve hundred. Alright, that's good for me. Now I wanna fight him. Oh, not enough burst. Not enough burst. Oh, but I am so scary to him. I am so scary to him. Alright. This is horrific. I mean, I will definitely take that. Nice. Even though he picks up those heals, he loses health overall. Um, I really want this blue buff, but I also don't want him to get red. Okay, he hit me, which means he, he didn't clear the wave. And I'm also pretty sure that I even traded with him. Oh, you're going to dash through, obviously. I do have alt back up. He's going for blue. Ow. Um. Okay. Gaia doesn't proc on... On what is it? On Mezes. Which is actually a good thing. Because I bought Maya... Maya. I bought Gaia hoping that it didn't proc. Because I want the power. Right, so we got triple buff control. I'm going to go grab my Curse Weaver. And upgrade this because it gives me more protection. Um, Next item, I want to buy Rod of Tahuti, but I also need a Divine Ruin. So, which one's next? Rod getting extra power is really nice. Soul Reaver would also be really nice. Devos would also be really nice. I don't know where he is. He didn't get Rock or XP Camp or Bull Demon. Okay, that owned me. At least my two still full clears, so we're chilling. Doesn't actually full clear, does it? That hit me. My alt got stopped. Oh, that is tragic. That is so unfortunate. Mega unfortunate. All right. He can't kill me. 
He can't kill me and he knows it. I'm just going to go divine here. Um, Hide of the Nemean is also a good item here, but it did get nerfed a bit, so it's not really worth picking up. Your middle tower is under not yet, at least. My Curse Weaver never actually went off. He never pressed any buttons other than auto attacks on me. This might be harder than I thought. And I do want this because it procs my three really quick, which is nice. Thank you. And then I want the XP camp. I'm literally just trying to farm XP right now. mind taking a little bit of damage there i didn't but like if i had to i wouldn't mind it he's waiting for red they carry life. i don't think he knows i'm here oh wait he's kind of getting owned Wait, I'm getting on. Wait, wait, wait. Does that stun? No, it stunned. No. Oh, man. Oh, man. It stunned. I didn't think he would double stun me in one fight. That's crazy. I also didn't have Divine finished. Curse Weaver did hit for 224, which is actually really insane. That's a lot of damage. I feel like I do want Reaver over Rod. Even though Rod got buffed, Rod is like twice the power that Reaver is. Um, I might be able to catch him. Oh, not enough, damn. I don't want him backing. Oh, that's that is sucky. That is sucky. I mean, at least I kept my Phoenix. That's pretty nice. But for how long? But for how long? Probably not that long, if I had to guess. We'll grab this. Oh, that dash actually did a lot of damage to him. Ooh. Oh, he gets red buff though. Crap. All right, kind of spooky. I could just go poly too. To be honest. All right, I'm getting a fire blink. And I'm going to do some nasty stuff to this man, hopefully. I missed. It's fine. Do we think he's just going to backdoor? The answer is 100% yes. Okay. Wait. Nice. Nice. He thought I was going to fight him because I thorns, which made him want to commit. He saw me thorns, which made him want to commit. And him wanting to commit means that I can just walk away and he dies. Nice. Thank you for the sub spoof. All right. Now the games are going well. That's Now I get his tower. I get finished. Soul River. I get a 500 pot. And I get some potions. I'm feel I'm looking pretty good. I'm feeling pretty good here. I just need to make sure that I get a good blink into like 
combo. A good blink in the combo would, would own him. Rise out. Okay, this is it right here. I think he's dead. Oh, no. Okay. Wait a second. Nice. Nice. Look at that fire blink, baby. That 500 damage fire blink. And the curse weaver pumping out 500 damage. Oh my god, look at this curse we were 500 fire blink 500 holy I knew it would be great. I knew it my story ever sucks, but Holy baby, let's go I knew it would own I can't believe it I cannot believe it. That's insane Holy crap I do feel like I should have gone Rod instead of Soul River, and I actually might still. I actually might still. You know what? In fact, I just don't I don't think it's good enough. I'm gonna go Rod. And I'm gonna go full Rod Glyph. Upgrade my thorn. Now I don't have Blink for this fight, and he will have red buff. Both activities stink, but. I'm kind of okay with it. And the reason I'm okay with it is because he has to push into me and I have fire minions. It's hard for him to push into me and actually like do well. You know what I mean? I can buy a lot of time with fire minions. I missed. Okay. It does take him a minute to play that way. I missed. There's a lot of damage. Something I'm not... I'm not taking a liking to. Nice damage. Holy shit. Look at that. Look at that damn. Oh, you're so dead. You're so dead. You are so dead. Oh my god. <laughs> Dude, the fire blink. The fire blink curse weaver combo is just doing so much. It's just doing... He has defense. He has defense for God's sake. Somebody help this man. Oh my God. We're doing numbies. I don't even know if I could win here, but Jesus Christ, I don't even think it matters. I'm pumping so hard. The Titan is half dead. That Titan is half dead. That did, dude, look at how much damage that did. It did 454 plus 186 plus 122 from the vine. He's just dead here. He's dead. Look, 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 look. <laughs> Look at that! Thorns, Curse Reaver, all! Oh. <laughs> Brother! Brother! He can't. What is he supposed to do? What's the counterplay? What's the counterplay? Beating it? I don't know. <laughs> That's insane, man. That is impeccable. <laughs> oh my God. I hope you guys enjoyed that game. If you did, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Until next time, y'all. Peace.